It is another rainy day in the, day in the bluegrass state, and we are going to Starbucks. We have never been wow. to the Starbucks. They always, uh, there's always a line though, yeah. There's always a line at Starbucks. And we don't even know, to be honest, if they're gonna have uh, what we are interested in ordering. So, I'm gonna turn you around here so I can talk to you. Um, we have, it has been recommended to us that we tried many different things from Starbucks. Um, there we go. That we try many different things from Starbucks. Um, we've had sandwiches, regular food recommended to us, and we've also had drinks recommended to us. Uh, but today, uh, we are just interested in what desserts they have. Specifically, uh, we were requested to try their cake pops. Now, I don't know what flavors they have. I don't, I have a no idea what they have because we don't drink Starbucks coffees. Now, if you follow my channel at all, I love collecting the Starbucks You Are Here series and the Been There series. I love the mugs. But just because I love the mugs doesn't mean I love the coffee. And the coffee's very, very strong and bitter to me. And, um, Oh, so, to me too. Yes, so we do not drink their coffee. So, um, for several years, I've been holding on to two gift cards from Starbucks. Um, and hopefully they're still good. If they're not, we'll pay whatever. Uh, I, we have money too, but um, uh, these gift cards, I have been holding on to them forever because... <laughs> People like to give them as Christmas gifts, and um, yeah, if you I don't drink the coffee, then it's really the, not a whole lot to buy. Exactly. So. I remember Ashley's first year of teaching. She got probably fifty dollars in Starbucks she card did. and doesn't drink Starbucks. So she would go, and her goal was to like try different things to see if she found anything she was crazy about, and she really, she really didn't. I mean, she, no, there was some kind of chocolate milkshake like she, that. She she tried like the hot cocoa, and she tried like the the glorified milkshakes is really what they are. I mean, truly, that's what they are. Those are the things that she tried to focus on, and it just wasn't something that. Um, like a lot of people have to have it at least once a week, if not once a day. And um, it just was, it's just something that our family um, has not embraced. And what's funny is at Disney, at Walt Disney World, they switched over from their regular like coffee shops to Starbucks. Yeah. So they're, they're Starbucks. Um, which is, it's neat because I can collect the mugs from Disney. Um, but then if you're not into that coffee, it's like, okay, this, you know, that's a waste for me because I'm not drinking the coffee. I'm just buying the mug. Um, but anyway, our goal today is to try to order, uh, we're going to see what flavors they have. We have no idea. I went to their website. I did not see cake pops listed on their website at all. Yeah. So maybe it's a regional thing. It, yes. Um, so if, I've seen pastries and stuff, but that's if we it. get up here and they say they don't have cake pops, then we will ask them uh, what like pastries they have and we'll go from there. But our goal today is to try uh, different cake pops and it is raining steadily. So uh, we are like one, two, we're like four cars back right now from the window, from the ordering, where you order. And they don't give you, just so you know, you don't get a window before the place, the point of ordering. So for us, for people who yeah, don't- Yeah, could have a menu back here. Yes, for people who don't come here and you're not familiar at all uh, with Starbucks, it would be very, very helpful for them to have a window like at this point for us to be looking because what's gonna happen- Huh? A menu. A menu. What does Window. Oh, a menu. <laughs> because what's going to happen is we're going to be those people who get up to the ordering point and we're going to waste time. It don't matter. They're, they're so backed up with just the checkout window that it, I don't think it'll matter anyway. But we are going to waste time because we didn't have a menu before this and, uh, and online it wasn't very helpful they didn't list everything and it's it it just what the menu the um the website just wasn't very helpful so anyway 
Um, we will check back in when we get up to the window and see what they say. Okay, they do have, right before you get to the window to order, I'm gonna show you. They have whole new Okay, cream. this is the window to order. So right before you get there, they do have this window, but it does not list cake pops on it at all. And I know you can't see because of Kevin's. No, can you point at Kevin? No, can you it just- It doesn't matter. You won't be able to see it, it's too rainy. To but I wanna show you, there's no cake pops on there. No. That's just what I wanted you to see. That's all you get. So we're still gonna have to ask. Hello, what can I get for you today? Uh, do you have any cake pops? Yes, we have the birthday cake, we have cookie dough, and we have chocolate. All three. We want one of each of those. Oh, all right. That's it. Oh, that's pretty today. That's it. All right, it will be 716. Thank you. I just had a thought once he finished ordering, I thought, I hope they're big enough for us to oh, yeah. get a cake. They're I, usually I like an Oreo ball. So we'll have to just be like, careful. Yeah. <laughs> we'll probably get the whole thing. half, yeah, we'll get half of half each. So, uh -huh. yeah. So it was seven something. So, so, so they're two more. something a piece. Yeah. Yeah, which is probably typical, but but you could, um, I'm gonna end up dropping these down in the seat, these gift cards, and we won't be on it. Listen, Kevin's car is terrible for that. The seats are really close, and I'm sure it's that way in all cars, but my phone, I can be, uh, he can be driving and turn a corner, and if I have this laying on my coat, it'll slide, and it'll go right down in that crack, and it just, Kills me, kills me. Because then you have to pull over somewhere and you have to push your seat back or push it forward and you have to dig it out. Because Lord knows I can't be for two minutes without my phone. So. Is there anything left on that? Um, yes, 784. Oh, okay. The total's right down there. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah, you too. So here are the three cake pops. Um, that's the birthday one, I'm assuming. I would guess this one's what, the darker one you think the is the chocolate and the lighter one's the cookie dough? That's what I'm thinking. We're not sure what the chart one. Anyway, that's what they look like. Um, they're about the size of an Oreo ball. That's about how big they are. Okay, these were two twenty-five each. So Which is a little silly. Six seventy-five, forty-one cents tax. Our total was seven sixteen. We had a gift card, but I'm letting you know in case you don't. Um, so we have no idea about calories or anything like that. Uh, this should be the birthday. Yeah, I would think so. It is pink and it has white sprinkles. I thought I'll focus it on. Mm. They, do, they don't last long, do they? <laughs> No, because it's hard to get a small bite. The second bite's easier. It does taste like birthday, though. Mm -hmm. It would remind you of a vanilla, a vanilla cupcake mm -hmm. is what it reminds me of. It's good. It's very sweet. It is very sweet. I like the vanilla flavor. It's just like a vanilla cupcake. And the, the texture does remind you of an Oreo ball. It's kind of got that mushy, mm -hmm. squishy texture inside. It's and good. those little um, white things all over the outside, they're they're a crisp, uh, but they, they really don't add anything but a different texture. You want this um, one next? Yeah, but that was good. I do like that good. birthday cake I don't know flavor. if it's $2 and something good, but it's good. I know. I think that's very expensive. Uh, this should be, I would think, the cookie dough. Um, Maybe. <laughs> now, see, I'm tempted to bite all those, but then you wouldn't get it. I don't care. I don't taste those little things anyway. Yeah, I would think that was cookie dough. It looks like cookie dough. Mm -mm -mm. That one's a little softer. I love that. That tastes just like... Mm -hmm. 
chocolate chip cookie dough, like raw chocolate chip cookie dough. That's probably what it is. When you're making cookies at home and you have that batter in the bowl, uh, the chocolate chip cookie dough, that is that is wonderful. Yeah, it's but, like an edible cookie dough. But it's a different texture because when you're making it at home, it, it's a, like a pasty texture. That is actually like a... Um, I don't know, it's pretty pasty. You don't think that's more... I think it's more... It's, it's a little more cake-like, but, it, but yeah. it's still, you could probably do that with... Cookie you probably dough. could. That is, it's delicious. I like that one Making honestly a, more than the birthday. I one. do too. It's more flavorful. Uh, put it into make it into balls and stick a stick in it and then put it in the freezer. Oh yeah. And then dip it in the chocolate. Yeah. That'd be really good. Of course, the uh, you can make it. I've made it before uh, eggless too. So you yeah. you can do eggless so that it's safe to eat. This is the just the chocolate. That looks like a little denser. That, that's almost brownie like because mm -hmm. it, it has that gooey texture yes it would remind you of um yeah a very um not very but just a dark chocolate browning yeah it doesn't have a bitterness but it's it's yeah it yes does. it's a deep uh chocolate but yeah it's not bitter it doesn't have any um there's nothing off-putting about it at all it's it it's still sweet but it doesn't have the sweetness that the others have. Yeah, that's my favorite one. And you're, I'm sure yours is the cookie dough one. The brownie one's your mm -hmm. favorite? Um, I like the brownie one a lot, but no, the, my number one is the cookie dough. Yeah, the cookie dough is really close second for me because they're both good. The The birthday's good, it's just a little plainer. Um, I, for me, my order would be different than Kevin's. I would say cookie dough first, birthday second. Oh, really? I really do like the chocolate. It does taste like brownie, but that's going to be my last out of the three. Yeah, um, I like the texture of it because it's got that goopy kind of texture. I like the texture too, and I'll get a picture of uh, the three of these of the inside for you so that you can, if, if you didn't see it during the video, you can see it close up at the end, pause on it or whatever you want to do. Um, but yeah, that so those are the only three they have out now. Um, I would think during the year they would have maybe a pumpkin spice or something like so. a peppermint at Christmas. You all the, the um, that are watching this video that go to Starbucks all the time, you can tell me what flavors of cake pops that you have had and uh, which one is your favorite because I would get that cookie dough. Well, what kills the me is there it wasn't listed on their menu. No, the menu didn't have really any desserts listed. No, on it's there not. At all. I did not see it on their website when I went, and it was not on that menu. You had, you have to know yeah, that they have, have it. Yeah. And I don't think that's a good business, really. They need it's to not. tell people. I mean, you might have a, a brand new person in the drive thru that has a kid with them or something, and the kid might, they would be crazy about these cake pops. But you, if you don't know they have it, how are you going to know to order mm -hmm. it? Yeah. Um, I don't know so, why they do stuff like that. No, so they really, really are uh, doing themselves a disservice by not having it on the menu so um, anyway um, I think they're good I don't know if they're worth two dollars but if you want the convenience of not having to make it yourself and just eating a, a, a dessert then, then I think they're good I do not as much as as good as they are I do not think they are worth 225 each no. I do not because I'm gonna eat that too quickly however it is delicious they are good if you're willing to pay the price if you're willing to pay the price then it's a good treat yeah. So, I hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching. Okay, update. I'm changing my mind. <laughs> I'm changing my mind. I'm going to say, because we just sat here and finished those three cake pops, uh, which is very easy to do. Oh, yeah, because three bites is gone. But I have to tell you, I changed my mind. Uh, my order is uh, cookie dough and then the, the chocolate. And then my, I'm going to switch my second and third. The birthday was just kind of boring. And the birthday after, yes, after eating more of it, it just was more boring. And I do like the chocolate, the flavor of that brownie more than the birthday. So I'm just switching my order. I just wanted to get that out there. Um, uh, but cookie, the cookie dough was amazing. Yeah, yeah, the cookie dough is really good. So just wanted to make that clear.